Hey guys, so it is Tuesday today. I'm starting my vlog off today for this week because yesterday I actually went to go get my nails done yesterday, but by the time I got like got started on my day and got to the nail salon, it was like 12 o'clock and it's school holidays at the moment, I think. So I knew that they were probably gonna like send me away and ask me to come back. So I did not end up doing that, but I just went to get my nails done. I absolutely love them. I get the coffin shape now and I got white with like glitter on this finger. I need to like cut my cuticles. I don't do it um, where I go. But anyways, I really, really love it. I have a tan at the moment. I would hate white nails if I didn't have a tan, but I love white nails with a tan. It's like my favorite thing ever, like legit. My nails are growing so, so long underneath my acrylics. Like I can't even believe it. Like I went to get my acrylics done for the first time in literal like probably six months about three weeks ago my nails were so short because i bite them and when this nail like my thumbnail came off um like a week ago and it just was so long like i couldn't believe it so i'm thinking like i might try the next time that my nails fully grow out to just take them off and try and let my natural nails grow underneath i'm so hard because i'm a nail biter but i'm really gonna try i'm really really gonna try to do it i'm wearing these sunglasses today just because i feel Feel like it's so boring wearing the same thing all the time and I have literally worn this top in the last three vlogs I think um I just really like this top I do wash it by the way oh fuck me didn't I wash it but I just um I don't know I feel like I only ever have one outfit that I ever wear at any given time and I think that I have no other clothes apart from that outfit usually. Yeah, these are the, um, the key on the prowl sunglasses. I never wear them like I bought them and I never wear them. I probably should wear them though. I just feel like they're so in your face you know what I mean like they're so reflective but I do like them I really do and I wear them all the way down here because you guys know but anyways yes yeah, so I just got my nails done I had the weirdest I just wanted to like come on and tell you I had the weirdest situation at the nail salon by the way I was like filming this whole entire vlog and it wasn't even recording I was so pissed I had the weirdest time at the nail salon I always like know people that are there at the nail salon like because they're always there and I used to go all the time but anyways, I went there today and there was like three people that I had never seen before. So one of the girls that I'd never seen did my nails and I wanted glitter, like the glitter that's on my um, ring finger on both hands, I wanted just all over, like by itself. But she was like, oh, it's really sheer, like do you just want clear glitter? And I like, in the swatches, like the nail swatches that they show you, it always looks so much more opaque than it is on your nails. So I didn't want just clear glitter, even though it was nice actually. I wanted something a bit more opaque, like an opaque glitter. I was like, oh no, I don't think I'll have that if it's gonna be kind of like sheer. Cause normally I paint my own nails. Like I had no intention of getting my nails painted today when I was at the salon, but I didn't know what to paint my nails and I thought, you know, I'm there and they have tons more colors, so I'll just get it done. So she was like, oh, it's, you know, really clear and everything like that. So then I was like, oh, do you have any like opaque glitter, which I don't think she understood what opaque meant, like not trying to be rude, but I don't think she got what that meant because she just looked at me weird. And then I was like, do you just have like a white and then I'll have like the glitter on. She's like, oh, do you want white with glitter all over? I'm like, maybe just on like one finger, like the accent look. Um, and she just like kind of laughed like and laughed at the the, uh, the other Asian girl that was like next next to me and then like started doing it but she was just like smiling and it was I was like really like what is wrong with that so, like do you not want white nails like do you not like them because I think they look bomb and then like when I left she was like all nice and she did a really good job to be honest with you like she actually was really good at it and she took her time but then when I left she was like staring at me and I'm like I'm sorry if I've offended you with getting white nails, but like, I think they look fucking amazing. TBH, like, I don't know what you're talking about. Like a week after I got my nails done, I banged my nail on a, a door and it like fell off. Like it didn't fall off, it ripped off and it fucking hurt. And so I went to another nail salon that I normally don't go to to get it fixed just because I really desperately wanted to get it fixed. It was this nail right here and it was so much shorter than this one. Like this one actually is longer than this one. I hate when they do that, but it's not that obvious, but it was so short and it was like round. Like it wasn't even like a coffin shape, it was round. And I didn't realize until I had left fully what it looked like, as you know, from like that position and stuff. And I don't normally look and like judge it while I'm in there. It was so sick. And it looked so bad, and I hate that because I know this is going to sound really funny, 
Well, I have this thing with acrylic nails where when I'm on, I'm just pretending this is my phone. When I'm on my phone and I'm texting or I'm scrolling Facebook or I'm like playing a game like Best Fiends, which I'm not sponsored. I just really like that game. I love my index finger to like hit the screen and that tapping sound is very nice to me. Like I love it. So um, it was so short that every time I would like, and it was like bent up, like it wasn't going down. It was bent up. So every time I would like touch my screen, like my finger would just hit it and I wouldn't actually feel the clicking sound of my nail and that really bothered me. Fast world problems everyone, fast world. Anyway, um, I just quickly went to Kmart too to get uh, just some natural eyelashes. So I just got some new lash glue. I get the Revlon Precision Lash Glue and then I got these lashes from Kmart. These are the ones that I get if any of you guys ever wonder. I normally just get cheap lashes because it's easy. And then I'm going through this phase at the moment. I really wanted a pair of like white Converse. I'm not a sneaker person at all. I either wear like just sandal type shoes or boots in the winter or I wear flats. But I'm going through a stage right now where I really wanted a pair of Converse. I just think it looks so casual but like cute at the same time. So I couldn't find Converse. I wanted like a fake pair anyway. I didn't want to buy like actual Converse shoes. I couldn't find a pair but I got these shoes and I don't know what these are called but everyone wears them and they're not as cute as converse i don't think but they're still kind of cute and they were literally four bucks like four bucks that came out are you shitting me by the way another weird thing that happened to me at the nail salon was you know that whole pokemon thing going on like the pokemon go game like i don't even know i never watched pokemon as a child but i went into the nail salon and the there was like this little like asian guy he was not little he's probably like I don't know, maybe my age or younger, he was sitting there watching the girl do my nails the whole time, which is really frustrating. I hate when people, there was like three people all staring, like watching her do my nails. He pulled up his phone and he's like, have you started playing this game yet? I'm like, no, Sir Bob, I haven't. I'm not running around outside trying to catch Pokemon. Are you joking? It's kind of funny. Like, I totally would do it, I feel. But I just, I can't be bothered. I honestly can't. And it probably is very sad if I did. Um, and I have no interest in Pokemon. As I said, I'm playing Best Fiends at the moment, which is totally not sponsored. I can't believe Best Fiends is so sponsored. Like, they literally need to stop. Like, stop what you're doing. You're fucking embarrassing yourself. Like, stop trying to get all these YouTubers. Like, it's so annoying. I'm going to go home now, and I'm going to do a few things at home. I need to clean my kitchen um, because there was a cockroach in my dishwasher, even though apparently, supposedly, I'm supposed to get pest sprays. Um, so anyways, by the way, if any of you guys are vloggers, I have a really, really good tip. If you get very nervous and worried about people seeing you vlog and talk to yourself in the car, what I recommend doing is don't look at them. Like there's someone right next to me right now, just parked a few spaces away that can probably see me, but I'm just not going to look at her and I won't know that she's looking at me. It's really foolproof. By the way, I absolutely love when big YouTubers comment on my videos. It's like literally, I thank girls so much that it's not even funny. Like last night on my um, video annoying shit that I do, Rani Bransby commented on my video and then Kato Potato commented on my video and she also commented on my Instagram post and I literally just was there crying for like 10 minutes because I was like, this is amazing. Hey guys, so it is Tuesday today and I am not wearing any makeup clearly because I haven't done it yet. So um, yeah, I'm thinking of going and getting a coffee and I need to do some stuff online today. I need to reply to comments. So. Get a regular mocha on soy milk, please. So I'm just on my way to the grocery store right now. I've been eating so badly lately. Um, I think just because of the weather and like, you know, just having a lot of time to just like eat. I've been eating so bad and I've gotten so many pimples from going back on dairy and just eating shit. I'm not energized. I feel so tired today, even though I slept fine last night, I believe. So I'm going to try and get some healthy foods today. Um, and just try and get back into it. I'm going to try and like exercise as well. I was going to work out this morning, but um, I had a headache as soon as I woke up because I think I'm like dehydrated. So I just have kind of like 
driven myself into a bit of a hole health wise at the moment um, but that is basically what I'm doing this morning um, I will try and vlog a little bit um, today and then tomorrow I'm seeing my friend again because she has an interview in town so yeah I kind of feel like I haven't really vlogged that much um, interesting stuff this week just kind of updating you guys but that's why I'm doing a weekly vlog because it's kind of just like a bit of a boring week for me I'm not really doing anything major Okay guys, just got back from the grocery store and I thought I would do a little um, a little grocery thing. Oh my god, by the way, do you guys know, I need to get rid of that orange. Do you guys know how my um, little furball thing from Kmart came off? This is actually off the Ariana Grande perfume, the one that comes on it. Um, I just decided to put in on my keys. So now I have another one. I don't know why I bought another one of those just for it to break when I had, I could just take it off the purpose. So yes, trying to go really healthy at the moment, get back to it. So I just got some um, steam fresh. I love seeing people's grocery hauls. So I thought I would show steam fresh, um, broccoli, carrots and sugar snap peas um, to have for dinner. I, I'm try I don't really eat a lot of chicken or red meat. I'm not a vegan, but I don't eat a lot of chicken or red meat. I do eat fish and tuna. I love fish and tuna. Um, and I'm trying to cut out dairy. I still have some dairy products in um, the cupboards, but I'm trying to cut out dairy because I just think it's like not good for you. So got that, got some spinach for um, smoothies, some bananas. I like to freeze these and put them in smoothies. And also um, you can have them for dessert if you blend them in a Nutribullet or a blender. Some cucumbers because I want to make um, green juice. Some lemons. I want to start having lemon water in the morning because it's really good for you in many ways. Got some um, Fuji apples for juicing. Got some sweet potatoes which I like to have for dinner. Some ginger for juicing. Some celery for juicing. Some frozen mangoes for smoothies. And then I got some strawberries and some blueberries. And then I just got this... Um, lemon squeezer juicer because I didn't have one and I also got this plastic thing just to store water in so that it's nice and cold um, when I get it in the morning and then I just got some steamed rice and quinoa I absolutely love this so much I ended up getting this um these kind of weren't like the like these are still really healthy but they obviously weren't as healthy as fruit and veg over though but um these are craisins fruit and nut trail mix I love these so much. These are the veggie chips, sea salt and vinegar. They're obviously a little bit healthier than just regular chips because um, I don't know what they're made in, but they're in like the health kind of food section. And then I got these veggie crisps um, as well, which these are really good for you. They're just literally like purple and orange sweet potatoes and taro. And then I got, oh my God, where's my brown rice? Anyway, so then I just got this stir-through um, sun-dried tomato and roasted garlic paste. I'm going to have that with quinoa. Some quick oats sachets to have oats in the morning. I was going to get ones that you cook on the stove, but I just decided to get the quick um, the quick oats one just because it's easier for me in the morning. So you just chuck that in. That health life, health AF, fitness, hashtag workout, hashtag fitness, hashtag Instagram model, hashtag fit bod, hashtag summer bod. Found me rice. It was in my car. Just finished doing a few things online and now I'm watching Supernatural season one. I don't know why I had the urge to start watching this again, but there's like 12 seasons. So bitch, I don't think I'm going to be fucking doing that. I'm not watching 12 seasons of a TV show, you feel? Damn, bitch. When I was younger, Dean was my man. I would have shagged him left, right and centre. In fact, I still would actually. Really, really ashamed that he's married. We are yet on another hike, <laughs> back at it again with the workout gear. extremely unfit we are just going up this hill god I need to go to the gym cut because it is hard anywho we don't actually know where this trail is going to lead exactly but 
we're hoping it's a great place because this is a tough uphill route. Expecto Patrolo! Bengardia Levio Star! Expecto Patrolo! Expecto Patrolo! We're just playing Harry Potter in the forest. In the woods. Run. And we're not drunk. Hermione. Ron. Hermione. Ron. Ron, Ron Weasley. Weasley. Dumbledore. Ron. Dumbledore. Ron. Dumbledore. Ron. 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 Me we to found get an opening. Oops. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're going to get killed. Guys, we made it back to civilization. There was a time there for a minute where I thought someone was going to get us. A car came. And we had to run all the way back onto the path. <laughs> My ankle. And I, I just fell over and Alyssa's rolled her ankle as well. So how do you feel after that? Like I've accomplished life. That was a really tough road. That was the toughest walk I've ever done. Yep. Mount Everest next? Yes. We played a bit of Harry Potter. Alyssa rolled her ankle as I said. And Jessel. I fell over. <sighs> And we got out to this open road and a car came and we got so scared because I've seen so many horror films that we ran back into the forest. We are forest girls. <laughs> Hello everybody. Welcome to yet another vlog for my week. Alyssa, stop Snapchatting me right now. So, um, I'm just about to film a video right now. It is Tuesday and I'm filming a what is on my iPhone slash how I edit my Instagram photos and I'm pretty sure that's what I'm going to be filming. So I'm going to do that and then I'm going to um, edit a vlog that I have that should have gone up yesterday but didn't because I was lazy and all I did yesterday was watch American Horror Story. Um, I don't know why because I literally just started watching it the other day and I was like I'm actually kind of into this but I'm only, I watched Freak Show and I watched um, Coven, but I'm not really interested in Asylum. I kind of watched that the other day and it freaked me out. It is my friend Alyssa's 22nd birthday, so Lissy Lulu, love you. Happy birthday to you. She is 22. Look at my ratchet background, guys. Like, legit, I can't deal. I literally have these lights like hanging up with blue tack. Like, honest to God. Like, thank God my camera kind of blurs because imagine like seeing that like that's not even fucking funny look at my hair like you can literally see holes in it like spaces my hair is so thin i can't even deal oh my god like i always try to get the ariana grande look but it doesn't work for me hey guys just shell banging on my bed just finished filming my video i think it went okay hi I've just finished filming and um, I think it went well. I'm hoping that it turns out well. It was really hard actually to show what was on my Instagram, what was on my phone because my tripod just wouldn't like bend down enough and touch your elbow. So I had to like hold the camera whilst I was trying to do it. It was really, really difficult. I had an urge like the other day at the grocery store to get chips. I don't know why I never ever eat chips, but um, but anyways, the foundation's like come off my freaking forehead. But anyway, so yes, I'm just gonna cook these now and then I'm going to edit. I just did the funniest thing. My old wig that I used to look at that. Is that not a dog? This is like done, like this wig. Like it was really cheap off of eBay and well it wasn't super cheap, but it was it was pretty cheap. And um, it's like done now, like it never ever looked realistic, but it's even like less realistic now. So I actually just had this idea to chop some hair off and then I bobby pinned it to my head and took photos with it because that's my life. I'm going to go have these now and probably watch a little bit of American Horror Story and then I'm going to edit. Um, I have so much editing to do. Well, not so much, but I have like two videos to edit. <sighs> I really need to learn how to like pre-film because otherwise you're just left with like shit I need to upload a video and I don't have one anyways that is what you get so I'm gonna go now to 